One Lafayette woman with stage four cancer is bringing light to a very dark diagnosis. 66 year old Rebecca Sullivan gave herself a challenge to run every road in Greater Lafayette. That's right, I said every road. She officially reached that goal just last week. So, News 18's Micah Upshaw, she joins us now in the studio to share that very uplifting story. Micah, good Monday morning to you. Hey, Marley, good Monday morning to you. Yes, definitely an uplifting story for the Monday morning. Now, Sullivan was diagnosed with stage four cervical cancer in January 2020. It took her about 10 months to complete this running challenge, and the news she received in the midst of it is an accomplishment you'll have to hear to believe. I remember for months, like every morning, waking up and going, Oh my God, I've got stage four cancer. I don't know how long I have to live. A diagnosis like this isn't easy to take, but Rebecca Sullivan has made it her mission to find a positive outlet. This journey begins several years ago when she started running as a way to exercise and stay active. And I started out doing half marathons, and then I was like, well, I want to see what a marathon is like, and then I ran a few marathons, and, and then it just kept morphing from there. She created a goal of running a marathon in every single state. She made it to 38 states before the COVID-19 pandemic struck our nation in 2020, canceling marathons nationwide. I was feeling like, oh my God, I don't know how long I have to complete this goal. And I've got to be doing something. I have to have a goal that keeps me alive. She decided to localize her running goal. Somewhere along the way, I got the idea like, oh, why don't I run every street in Lafayette? I mean, I've lived here almost 30 years. And I, there were so many streets I've never been on. This is the map she used to navigate her challenge. She used a red pen to mark every street she touched. As you can see, she didn't miss one road. It's like, oh, I missed that one, so I drove and ran two minutes. She loves the goals, so I, it was, I knew it was good for her. Rebecca's husband, Dave, has been her biggest support through her journey. You can do it. <laughs> one more step. We all have challenges and adversities and you know it's how we approach them that really counts. Sullivan credits her new chemotherapy treatment as well as her positive outlook on life for the recent news she received. Of the last CAT scan they found no evidence of disease. Doctors aren't calling her cancer free just yet but she's approaching it the best way she knows how. You can turn your life experience into a tragedy or you can turn it into a hero's journey. And I choose to turn mine into, you know, something positive. Now, Sullivan will be starting a new running goal soon. She plans to cover all the Tippecanoe County roads next. So if you see her, make sure you give a wave and a smile. I'm reporting in studio, Micah Upshaw, News 18. What an awesome story that is.